Council resolved yesterday to uh, allocate funds to fix the Maui base track, a sum of $718,000. A considerable amount of that figure is around the earthworks that needs to be put into place to remediate uh, the, the mount, the mount base track. The geotech advice has been that the track will be very sustainable and it will be very strong. Today we are looking at excavation of the um, excess spoil from the slip from 2017, um, cutting into the bank and moving the track or the existing track closer into the embankment. It'll be very similar to what was here before the slip, however it'll be moved further into the upper slope um, with a handrail on the edge. While it appears to have happened quickly, the reality is that Council's had nearly three years to look at remediating the track. We have moved really quickly in uh, the terms of the, the budget allocation which had already been allocated and it was some, I think, uh, $4.65 million. So we didn't need a fraction of that to fix the track. The reason we've been able to move forward so expediently on fixing the track is we were able to bring together all the key players, which are the Mauau Trust Board, representing the three iwis who own the Monga, uh, Heritage New Zealand, which have been critical part, you know, assessing the history of the area where the slip is, and they've been, uh, they've been very supportive of it. And of course, with um, contractors in Tauranga City Council. So it's been enabled by particularly bringing iwi together to say, look, we want a partnership with you. We want to uh, use this as an exemplar going forward of doing a number of different projects around the sub-region. Absolutely brilliant as a local because the, the mount is so important to the whole uh, uh, culture of this area, particularly with the cruise ship season coming. Uh, that'll be great to see people being able to go around it and just enjoy the, the whole aspect of the mount. It's a wonderful facility to have. All going well, it will be fixed by Christmas.